Jay Kavnis with the Asbestos Institute. And I want to talk through briefly the model accreditation plan, or uh, as it's known regulatorily, the Asbestos School Hazard Abatement Reauthorization Act, or ASHARA. The model accreditation plan was originally an appendix located in the AHERA regulation, the school's regulation for safe management in buildings. And basically, AHERA, or I'm sorry, the model accreditation plan requires certification of persons that conduct what EPA calls response action work. Now, a response action means three things. Number one, the work to be done is inside the building. Number two, the amount of work to be done is greater than maintenance level, or what we typically have facilities maintenance personnel conduct. And number three, the material is friable and asbestos containing. Friable means that when the material is dry, it can be crushed, pulverized, or reduced to powder by hand pressure. If a contractor or building owner is planning on working in a building with asbestos containing building materials, and the job meets those three criteria, that's going to trigger the requirement to be accredited under the model accreditation plan. If you have any further questions regarding the model accreditation plan or any of the other asbestos regulations, please contact us at the Asbestos Institute. Thank you.